Hi everyone, this is Bethany, Be A Crafty Girl, and I just wanted to share some hauls, um, a collective haul type of thing, and then I'm going to do some update types of things at the end of the video. The first thing I got in the mail uh, was this Close to My Heart stamp set, and uh, it is called love clusters um, C1484 and um, it's really neat uh, this is the base image or this heart is the base image if you have that Cricut cartridge um, you can cut out the heart and you can cut out the butterfly and then stamp these on um, but then what's really cool is it comes with these extra little stamps that fit on top of this so it's a two-step stamp type of thing it's so, like you can stamp this in one color this whole image in one color and then like this fits on top of these and this one fits on top of this one and this one fits on top of this one I just think it's really neat and I don't think they'll be hard to fussy cut because I don't have that cartridge I only have like three close to my heart stamp sets but I really liked this one. I think it's really cool. It'll be neat for a card. And I got it for $8. And I think that's pretty good. So I picked that up. And it was brand new. Off Yard Seller. If I didn't say that already. And then another thing I got in the mail was uh, I ordered from Market Street Stamps. They had, um, they were retiring some of their stamps. And I kind of freaked out a little bit. <laughs> So I got two uh, that were retiring. I got Computer Cutie MS11 or MSS11 and uh, you make me lol. That's on the little laptop. It's just adorable and it's really big. Um, I did not pay this. It was half off because it's retiring. And then I got this one that is also retiring. Blast off MSS. Oh, eight. Um, make good boy cards and also a nice size. And then I got some new stamps from them. While I was getting those, always look on the right side and it's nice and big. And then uh, this is the Persimmon Studio collaboration with them. MSSMM. KG07 Fishy. Don't just float, swim. And it was, it's a nice size, it's pretty big. And then, uh, so it's a sentiment, and then it's nice that the bubbles are separate. That was a nice surprise. And then I got, I love this one. Peas, carrot, peanut, uh, tea or coffee. Donut, bacon, cupcake, coffee, or a tea, and an egg. And it says, We belong together, love. And the little hearts. So you can like stamp the peas and the carrot and then put like the little hearts in between them. Super cute. And I think this is a peanut. You tell me. I'm not quite sure. But I think it's a peanut. We'll have a vote. What do you think that is? <laughs> All I know is that it's cute and I liked it and it's good size. Ta -da! And then I got the honeycomb background stamp. And it's just a little hex. I like it a lot and it's cute. So I picked that. Those are the stamps I got from there. And then I went to a couple stores. I went to Mangelson's and I picked up this smooch glitz in frost and I really like it. It paints on and dries really fast. I also picked up the Heyday 6x6. I was not going to get this and then it jumped in my hands. <laughs> no, I think the sizes of the patterns are really nice for cards. Because sometimes even in 6x6 it's like the patterns are still too big like you can't see them once you start building on top of them so these are balloons with text in them 
a grid, a polka dot. Um, it kind of reminds me of a gingerbread house roof. Um, a grid, parquet floor, uh, typewriters. Uh, geometric pattern, wood grain, another geometric pattern, and this is waves with text, and a teal that um, graduates down to dark, bikes, uh, roses, and a neat hexy pattern, uh, more of that text in waves, in white, and then numbers. So yeah, I really liked the pattern size on that. And then I picked up another one of the Shoreline because I've been blowing through the first one I bought. And then I picked up the stickers as well. My favorite one is Stay Cool with the rainbow um, snow cones super cute. So I picked up this. I'm not really a sticker person, but uh, since I got another one of those pads, I figured this might come in handy. Salt water and sunshine. And there's a lot of stickers in there. And then I also, oh sorry, I bumped the camera. They also had the new uh, We Are Memory Keepers Hall Pass collection. So I got two of the stamps. Got two of the stamps. Sorry, something strange is going out in the hallway. It scared me a little bit. <laughs> They're 99 cents. So this one has the handwriting lines, an apple, then some journaling type stuff. This one um, has some little emoticons and uh, all the little sayings fit in the two word bubbles. And I needed word bubbles desperately, so I picked that up. And then here's the paper. It is really cute. Um, letters and numbers. Maybe you do get, do you get three? One, two. That first one I got three of, for reals. The others I got two of. I'm not, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> so red, a polka dot with grid. This is my favorite, uh, the books. A green pattern, uh, the little word bubbles, which is cute. A frame. I got three of this one too. What is going on? Okay, so some of them you get three of, and some of them you get two of. <laughs> um, rulers. Uh, this one's really neat. It has like little embellishments you can cut out, like a schedule and a report card and a hall pass. It's just really cute. That's a library card. Uh, colored stripes, another pattern, borders, which is cool. I will use all of these borders because I love them. <laughs> and another uh, framed, another framed, uh, some little banners, some lockers, and then this is uh, a testing bubble sheet. And this is also a testing bubble sheet. This one has like your name and identification number and gender and you know, that us old people know of. <laughs> it just kind of amazes me. Um, even between me and high school kids, I mean, I'm not young, I realize that. <laughs> but even between me and the kids that are in high school now don't know what those are is kind of amazing to me but um so that was Mangelson's and then I also went to Archivers I picked up some things that were on their little um, last one in the store little rack that they have so I got this stamp set it uh, matches the life of the party uh, paper line from basic gray and it had to come home with me because that cotton candy is too cute and that ice cream is too cute and that pinwheel is too cute so it had to come home with me <laughs> so 
so I picked that up. It is adorable. And talk about really big. I mean, it's like massive. But there's like the other stamps in the stamp set. Love it. And then they also had these on that same rack. Last one in the store. And they go with the lime twist. This one goes with fly kate. And they're just like the little doodads. The frames and stuff. But I have all those collections now. If you're the person that wanted to see those collections, I will definitely show them. Someday. <laughs> I promise. And then this one goes with Life of the Party. And then I picked up some white envelopes there because I was there and they were there and I got them. <laughs> and then I got this Unity stamp. Hello, my friend. I love that heart image. Love it. This one's really neat. It's a Stampin' Bella. All of these sentiments fit. You can stamp inside that frame, which is too cool. And then here's some uh, Twinkle Goosebumps in a teal aqua and a purple. Really pretty. I went to get this stamp set. It is called Chit Chat. I really wanted this thanks and the feel better and the God bless, but all of the stamps are really good staples for card making. I got the Everyday Eclectic, which is double sided. It is super cute. I'm glad I got it. Hexies, the clouds are amazing. Uh, cameras and then on the back of the cameras is like real photographs of like carnivals it's really cool and then um, a, quatre, a quatre foil pattern more hexes uh, some doilies it's really neat I would recommend that one it's super cute and then I got one more collection I got um, The Great Escape. I think my computer is dinking. There we go. <laughs> I got, uh, it's not The Great Escape, it's just The Escape by a little yellow bicycle. It has borders, um, buildings. This one's double sided too. Uh, those little tiny cameras are adorable. Um, it's really cute. The clouds are also cool. And I like the colors on this one. It's, it's not really girly, but it could be for girls. It's, you know, more boy colors, but doesn't, it's not like a boy. And then I also got the tear out journaling cards. Ooh, I've been done. That's sad. But they're just really fun to go with the collection. Once upon a trip. That's adorable. And then I got the little blings to go with that too. I don't usually do that, but I treated myself. Alright, so update type things. Uh, winner of the giveaway will be announced on the 25th at some point in time. <laughs> and uh, thank you to everyone who entered. And uh, yeah, and I'll, I'll do a whole video. So yeah, that's going to happen. Uh, swap. People have asked me about the whole swap thing. Um, planning, in the planning stages, so yes, I am going to host a swap. It's going to be a card and goodies, and it's not going to be a huge thing, so don't freak out when you hear me say that, but uh, it's going to be a card and goodies swap, and more about that later. I will do a whole video on that. Um, so just so everyone's aware that that's what it's going to be and watch for a video. And then um, my dad's doing.